We live in Missouri on Lake of the Ozarks. There's an amazing amount of money at this lake. It's become the Midwest playground for the wealthy. They play hard and they have fun and then all of a sudden something goes wrong. And they call us to get their toys back. I'm Terry Hart. I'm Sue Hart. I'm Corinne Hart. We are modern day treasure hunters. We bring up million dollar boats. Helicopters. Rolexes. Diamond rings. One false move can kill you. Drunk boat drivers. Equipment failure. I've seen lightning hit the water five feet from my boat a million times. We will go out in absolutely any kind of weather. When it's an emergency, it's an emergency. The helicopter went down on the 15 mile mark. Put that rope over the front. Oh no! There's always something that can go wrong. I risk my life for people's stuff. Everything anybody wants me to look for at the bottom of this lake has a story behind it. I hear this kaplunk, and I'm like, uh-oh. I don't want to tell my wife that I lost my wedding band. I've looked pretty much here. Husbands will throw their wedding rings in the water. You bitch. <laughs> Maybe it's over on this side then. OK. And when they wake up the next morning, they know they have to have me go get them. Oh, I have the $100 bill. OK, cool. Actually, you charged me 50 last time. Kids have driven their parents' cars into the lake. Which one of you guys has the credit card? The wedding dress dropped by the bride's mother. Yay! Terry's the man. Anything else? Cheers. The more people drink, the more mistakes they make, the more money we make. Thank you very much. We'll charge double if we find it, half if we don't. All right. But it's tough when they're crying to tell them. There's a chance we're not coming up with it. Sometimes we are lucky enough to get there before the boat sinks. When a boat decides to go under, that's pretty sudden. You have a boat that's going down, and you have to get this boat next to a dock. There you go, that's all we need. But slipping between a boat and a dock will crush you. You try to stabilize the situation, get these big pumps going, and stuff anything in the holes and cracks. Okay, great, you just made it back up. Anything can happen, and you've always got to be thinking, am I ready to take okay, care of it right now? It was a nasty nightmare. I love the job. It pays the bills. What more can you ask for?